In this video, I'll be using group policy to remove browser essentials button from Microsoft Edge. I'm starting this video from my GitHub page and that's because there are a few bits of information here that I will be using for this video. And I will leave the URL in the description down below. Also, in the bottom of the page, you can find more of my videos that are related to this topic. For example, here you can find videos about my Windows Server setup. And there is also a video about installing policy templates for managing Microsoft Edge settings via group policy. And now I'll begin this video by going to Vendor Workstation where I have my Windows Server environment. And here I will be creating my group policy. So I'll go to Tools, Group Policy Management. Then I will right click on Group Policy Objects and select New. I will name the policy Edge Settings. Then I will click OK. I will expand group policy objects. I will select the policy that I created. Then I will right click on it and select edit. And I will be creating this policy for my computer. So I will go to computer configuration, policies, administrative templates, and then Microsoft Edge. And somewhere here we should have this performance folder. And here we are looking for this setting right here called pin browser essentials toolbar button. I will click on it. I will disable this policy, click apply and OK. And that's basically it. Now I'll close this window, go to details and for GPO status, I will select user configuration settings disabled because currently this policy has only computer settings in it. And after creating the policy, I need to assign it to an organization unit that is holding the computers on which I want to deploy the settings. In my case, the organization unit will be this one. It's called computers and it is holding all the computers in my domain. So I'll click and hold on the policy and then drag and drop it on the organization unit. And as you can see, the policy appeared here and also in the list here. And that's basically it. Now to test this policy, I will go to one of my client machines that I have here. I will open Microsoft Edge. And as you can see, currently I have the browser essentials button here. And that's because even though I created the group policy, I didn't give it enough time to update on my client machines. So I'll do it manually. I will go to my start menu, search for CMD. I will type pp update, press enter, and now we need to wait a bit. And as you can see, the policy update was successful. If I go to Microsoft Edge, you can still see that I have the browser essentials. But if I close Microsoft Edge and reopen it, I don't have the button no longer. And that's basically it for this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And see you in the next one.